6.30 a.m. Sun's coming up. No ice on the lake yet. But, uh, hey, I gotta get busy. I got Audra from Jersey History Hunters coming. Mikey Iffy Signals and his dad. Jared, History Huntsman. And, uh, I don't know if Tim's gonna make it or not. I'll wait and see. All right. Gotta get my stuff together. Audra doesn't know it yet, but I got a little gift for her. For her next, uh, Our next uh, get together. Come out swinging. Not come out swinging, sorry. Dig it, dude. The gathering. So I'm going to give her this one of the prizes. The old wash basin and bowl. All right. Hope you like it, Audra. And good luck to whoever wins it. All right. Also got my uh, neck mounted uh, phone holder recorder. Charlie, you digging it back, Gammy? I'm going to be taking that today, using that as well. All right, let's get busy. Also got a few stickers to give to Audra for her sticker giveaways. Woo! -hoo. All right. It is about, I don't know, 7.30. <laughs> Sun's coming up. It's 33 degrees out right now. Supposed to get up to as high as uh, 50 by early afternoon. The sun's coming up just over the island on the lake. And by next June, the sun will be coming up over there somewhere. All right. I gotta get busy now. See you soon. All right, one of my items fell off my relic board here. Glue it back on. Hey, Audra, remember that piece you gave me? I love that thing. All right, let's get this to glued back on. Woo, here we go. Right. Hopefully, it stays this time. Thimble. I love this piece of brown pottery. It's got like a flower thing on it. Really thick. And one of these is patented December 25th. Right there. 1906. Sweet. Alright. Hey, hey, hey. I'm only about two minutes away. Oh, that sun is bright. Headed on down this road here. I'm on the road that the, my permission's on. And I'm going to meet up with uh, Audra, Jersey History Hunters. What's up, dude? Pew, pew. She uh, texted me a half hour ago. Says, Mike, I'm early. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I'm leaving now. I'll be there in about 45 minutes to an hour. I'm only about 35 minutes in. I'm almost here. So that means a good time. That's awesome. As soon as I go underneath the power lines, we have the house. 1800s. And just after that is a big hay field. I used to have a 1700s house in it. It's funny because watching the uh, TV show 1888, I remember way back when when they had smallpox. If they, I know of a you know, place in East Hampton that uh, had like six homes and they all contracted smallpox got smallpox, whatever, and they end up burning the whole village down. And to this day, it still just sits there, and they abandoned it, and I don't think anybody's ever been back. But, I thought, wow, that's a beautiful 1800s huge house. Well, I gotta stop there one of these days. So many on this road. But, uh, yeah, so I wonder if they, I know it's a lot of 1700s houses I've been to, or 1800s, 1800s houses I've been to. There used to be a 1700s house on a property that burned down, possibly because of small blocks or possibly because of an accident on a flyer, I don't know. Uh, looks like Fred is home, the owner. I see his truck there. Uh, I'm going to get over here. I see Audrey over here, dude. And oh, I see another one. Jared's already here waiting for me. I'm pulling in now. 
These guys are like, huh? What? Where's my dude? <laughs> Sweet. Right, go get them some big hugs. We'll get back to you. Stay tuned. Yeah, never I figure I'll film it when I get out of the car. Hell you wait. Hey. Ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas. Merry oh, Christmas. good. That's single. Oh, my God. What's it been? Two years? Yes. I was thinking, was it two years? Three years? Thanks since 2021. Two you, I think you came in 20 and in 21 again you came. Yeah, it was before... I didn't have one last year. No. I wasn't doing too good. It was a hot mountain one, right? Yeah. There he is. What's up, bud? Good to see you. Thanks for coming again, man. Appreciate it. You guys got to come to Jersey next. This fall, I'm thinking, speaking of which, I got a gift for you. Oh. They, already saw the, they already saw the video, but I'll show it to you. Yeah, Mikey found a large scent in a crota bell right over against the woods line over there. Yeah, that was a good day. Mikey, yeah. if his signals made it. His so dad's Steve. Has never been hunted before? Not, no, well, until I got found nice. it. That's great. You know, I think this is my fourth collab here now. Yeah. And I think we found six 1,700 coins wow. and three 1,800 coins. Nice. So. You think there was ever like an encampment or something here? No, there used to be a house right here, and that was the well in the middle where the rocks were sticking up over there. Okay. But uh, it burned down, so I don't know if the people had smallpox or yeah. if it was just a accidental burn down or whatever. Permission. I got a hold of this guy three years ago, and I hunted the backside of his property on Route 82. There's two other cellar holes, okay. and I found some stuff. But his property adjacent to North City of Norwich's property, and there's a cellar hole there, so I got that permission. But that gave me permission around those other cellar holes around the big reservoir that we, oh, yeah. we went to. Yep. So we've been doing those for a couple of years, and I haven't been back here. And I said, I drive by every once in a while. I said, I got to do his house. Yeah. So I called, hey, friend, any chance I can do that? Ah, stop in. Oh. Then, hey, you mind if I bring a friend? Oh, no problem. I'll just say, sure, I don't care if she comes. Do you have so, to let him know each time you come? Or? I, yeah, I just text him. Mike, you're welcome here anytime, he says. I just, I just text him yesterday. He said, friend, it's going to be beautiful 50 tomorrow. I'm going to bring some people down. Oh, good. We're going to yeah. have a good time. Oops. Nice. Yeah, I had to bother, bother Audra real quick to film me because like, I, mean, I haven't learned to film myself yet. So hang on. <laughs> Who's All that right. guy? I'm out today with Mikey Iffy Singles Day is Two for my first time ever with a Day is Two. Just got a slamming signal here. 79. So I'm going to say is it brown? So I'm gonna go down on this round and see what we can find. I was wrong. All right. So the next hole, be good, be safe, and have some fun. Leave a comment and chat. Let me know if you're enjoying this or not. Richie, are you entertained, my friend Madison Maine? Let's find out. <laughs> Wait, give me a finger. Oh, I want to take a picture. Hold on, let me get back. All right, Mikey, if you signal, call me over. Said he got slamming 47. Mr. Yeah. Smiley himself. <laughs> I'm the manicure, no less. Yeah. Switch yeah. it up. He let me use his day as two today. I got a dandy a minute ago. He just got himself a 1932, maybe, Montville dog tag. Congrats, brother. Thanks, buddy. It's awesome. That's very cool. First time I've seen the manicure in action. On the next you hole. can swap if you want. If you want to try that one. Yeah, okay, we'll do that. Well, we'll test them all today. <laughs> Steve over there, Mikey's dad. I got Jared and Mikey over there. Audra. I just got a slam in 6162. Dang it up. You know, they half around us there. I'm gonna guess it's a button. Let's take it get a picture. I'll come back to you. Alright, let's get this thing up out of here. Well, it might be a full shank on it too. Let's take a look see here. Oh yeah, got something there. Let me uh Got the toothbrush. I'll give this a quick, a quick cleaning. I'll take a closer look. All right, button and a half, two shanks. On to the next. Let me clean this up. I'll be right back in. Right, hand it over to 
apologize if you see anything. Clean that off. Yeah, another nice beautiful button. There's some shankage there. It looked like Tombat material. It was starting to be so shiny there, but I'm not seeing the uh, shank I thought I'd see for being Tombat. Let's get over and see what Audra got. Anything good. How you doing, Audra? What's up, dude? Uh, anything good yet? Any relics? Oh, I just found this. Ah, oh, dude. I'm a tool. Tom back button. That's what I thought, but it doesn't have the volcano type shank, yeah. uh, you would think. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Mikey just found a uh, 1932 dog tag. Ooh, sweet. If he signals, yeah. Nice. This little design, something, something on the back. Cool. When you're ready, let me know. We'll take a walk around the house. Heck yeah. Mikey said he, was, he wanted to go check it out, too. And those two fields are and no one's ever been out there. I know they've been plowed. Right. And over the years, they've been settled, so. Whenever you want. All right. All right, just got to slam a signal in this hole. Just dug it up. The first one out of here, folks. I know I'm giving you a little hard time here, but they this close, blah, blah, blah. All right, end up being an Indian. Beautiful uh, wreath with the shield on top of it there. And I was close. 1876. I was hoping for 77. Maybe next time. All right, we're going to take a trip around the house and hit the two fields in the back. Behind the house. We'll get back to you. Come on along. Let's see what we find. Of course, now i got to do a Jason the quarter order. Hide your banana peel under the ground. But good luck. Although I'm having good luck now. Two buttons. Tim, give me a button. That's three and a half buttons. Three and three quarter. And an Indian head scent. Mikey got a 32 dog tag, and let's go see what else he got. You know, Audra's just left to go get some water and something to drink. I got a slam in 92 here. I didn't know what I was chasing, but it ends up to be this button here. Looks like a two piece with shankage. It says something about E A V E S and company. Not sure, but uh, yeah. Pretty cool. Another relic save. It's like three or four buttons today. All right, on to the next. All right, Mikey's leaving on me. He's gonna take his day as two. Right when I get this, folks. Can you yeah, believe you it? Enough. You gotta. You Come gotta, on, dude. No more day as two for dude, you. Dude, that, that's bigger than quarter. Yeah. Oh, oh. go ahead, get it for me. It's kind of light. Oh, is it? The washer. Oh no, 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 no. It's a coin. You sure? Yep. It looks odd. Oh man, it's a coin. Look at that. It's a bobber. No! No, that's oh damn it. It's a Kennedy. Oh, that's the one I buried last week. Is it? Two weeks before I forgot. Oh my god. I buried this for You're taking I, your own shit up. I forgot I buried this one. I got the coin spill for for good luck. Oh, man. oh shit. It looked like a bobber at first. Oh well. Oh look there's a reindeer on it too. <laughs> oh well. Jeez. I just said he got a flat button. Take a look at it. I just got a signal. I'm not sure what it is. I think it was like a 15 or 16. But again, it looks like there's something on that one. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, bent over shankage, maybe? Hoping it was a little Indian when I pulled it up, but it wasn't. <laughs> I just got done with Jared over there with his button. I just said she got some roundness in the hole over here. Let's see what she got. I got about four or five buttons myself now. A half dollar I planted four weeks ago. My coin spill. If I found it, I forgot I planted it. All right, let's see what she got over here. I want to see it. Where is it? Right there in the sidewall? Oh, dude, that's big. Oh, mm. I'm going to call copper just so I want you to find a copper while you're here. It all came out. I pushed it back in. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, that's coinage. I'm thinking. Oh, dude. Oh, no. Oh, oh. 
Oh, no, I see it. Don't rub it. It's got a tan on it or something. Is that, what is that? Dude. Is that a tan? Mm, I'm going to take pictures when you're done looking at it. All right. Second dog tag today. First one was a 1932, I think. Mikey, if he signals Doug from Montville. And Jared swinging over History 79 and uh, History Huntsman here. Just dug a 1966. 1966 dog tag from Montville. He just gave it to me to put it in the displays for Fred. Very nice. What do you got? Coin. Oh, you got a coin right here. It's a nickel. Jefferson? Not 43 silver? Nope. Clad nickel. Audrey just found a 10 pence from 1975. You'll see it in her video. And uh, yeah, pretty cool. Gonna put this in a display for the homeowner Fred. 1800s house over there. He owns all this land. Very nice guy. Got to meet everyone today. All right. I don't know how much longer we're gonna stay, but it's making for a great video today. All right, we'll catch you on the next. Until the next find. You could be safe and have some fun and leave a comment in the chat. All right, Merry Christmas. It's the 16th of December, the day before my 60th birthday. I got wonderful people like this out here sharing it with me. Second one today. Mike, you got a 1932. It's a 1966. <laughs> Jerry Friday just gave it to me so I can put it in the display for the owner. Oh, nice. Montville. That's where we are. That is cool. I love dog tags. Can't believe two in one day. 66. Yeah. Let's see. Three years after I was born. Let's see you. Notice how Audrey ain't saying anything? Oh, yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> the year before me. Oh. <laughs> My sister is a 68. You could have that, uh, that watcher, that 75 clad if you want. Oh. <laughs> That's good. That was fun. I know. That's, that was, I don't know. I think you put it there. Me? You, you were one of your friends. No. You get someone all excited, a big brown. No, I get myself excited on my own, <laughs> on my own plants. 75. I know, it's crazy. All right. Me, the dumbass, didn't notice. I was looking on the bottom for the date, and it's not on the bottom <laughs> below her. It's up at about the 2 o'clock position. 1723. Half penny. Wow, dude, that's the most beautiful coin that came out of here. 1723. That's going to be my thumbnail for the, for the video. There we go. Hey, right, he's got a slamming. You no, know, 2933 on my Equinox. 90 on the dais. 90 on the dais. So let's see if he got another coin here. He just got a Hibernia, 1723. Can you believe it, Audra? I love it. That's nine or ten coins from the 1700s now. Scooch it this way a little so the sunshine can get in. Oh, it's deep. I said six inches on my machine. It's got the XP pinpointer. Come on, don't be a disappointment. Heartbreaker. The curse of the live dig. I see the big old grub there. Horseshoe. No. Oxen shoe. That's not it. That's not it. Where'd it go? That is it. What is that? Is that a printing plate? The coal? What yeah. is that? Is? It looks lead, but it's kind of copper patina on it. Hmm. I can see why it would be a good signal. Yeah, definitely. Big looks like it broke off of something. Heartbreaker. Put over your machine, make sure that was it. Right. Yeah, another signal. What was the signal? 71. Oh. Oh, dude, look at the fancy little gold guild look. maybe on there, too. Look at that thing. It's got some stuff on it. One day we'll make it back to the truck. Bent over shank. Yeah, we're heading back to the cars, but we keep finding stuff. Like Hibernias and buttons. Here, it's another Hibernia. Oh, wow. He thinks he's got another Hibernia with a harp here. Oh, 26 signal on the Knox, headed back to the cars once again. There's two there. coins on the way back to the car now. Let it dry up a little bit. 
Oh yeah, I think I'm seeing the heart come out now. It's the heart, right? I think so. Oh yeah, facing to the right, right here. So if I flip it this way, I think it might be a harp down the bottom. Definitely Britannia there. Let me get my magnifier out. That's one thing I love about metal detecting. You never know if you're going to find 300-year-old coins and buttons, to 100-year-old dog tag licenses, to military items, to barrel taps, to old toys. Every day is like Christmas morning. Hey, hey, everyone. Thanks for tuning in today. I do appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed the uh, video today. What a fun day. It was so cool to get to see Audra again. I think it's been two years now. Jared made it out again this year, which was cool. I think two or three times now. I can't believe I only plan on having two collabs there. I end up having four this year. But hey, the year's not over yet. I might have one on December 30th. If it's nice out that Saturday, I'll be back there again. Uh, I got the chance to go around the house, around the garage again. Hit the back two fields, but they weren't uh, eight or anything, so it was kind of difficult. But, uh, man, two dog tags were found, 1911, 1966. Jared uh, and Mikey are going to give them to me. and Well, Jared gave me his. Mikey's going to give me his for uh, the homeowners for the display. I thought that was cool. And then two Hibernias, two dog tags, two Hibernias still in that field. Well, it gets me, though, those two Hibernias were in the same area that one third of the field that we hunted on all four collabs. That was all that was available the first collab with James and Rebecca. But uh, yeah, it's funny. Uh, I know there's more stuff there. Just have to get back to it. But hey, I'm glad you uh, tuned in tonight. I'm glad uh, you're able to join us and and uh, join in, in, in in the chat there. And uh, and uh, what's up to say Friday? I don't think there's anything on after me. I don't. I don't know. I'll have to. Look into that so I can promote there. You guys go over and watch them. Whoever ends up going on that after me. I can't remember. You know, Saturday night. So uh, there's some people on and stuff. But. And uh, well, who knows? We'll see what happens. That's all. It's the only video I got left right now. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if we go out again on uh, New Year's Eve day, I'll have another one in a couple weeks. So thanks for tuning in. And until next time, be good, be safe, and have some fun. Be out there and find something good like... Uh, all American Women Relics always says. You guys have a Merry Christmas, and I uh, hope Santa's good to you. Ho, 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 ho. We'll see you later.